Hi, my name is John McKegg. I'm a licensed real estate representative with Royal LePage RCR in Alliston. I'm preparing a series of short videos covering topics related to real estate. I get asked from time to time about uh, concerns people have regarding real estate, uh, specific questions. I'm taking the most common of those topics and I'm putting them uh, the, my responses in video and it allows uh, anybody and everyone to uh, listen to um, my opinion on these things. Uh, I've been in real estate since 2000 so I've come across um, all of these items from time from time to time and very well versed in those areas. Again, I'm not providing professional uh, expert opinion on these things. You need to call in the experts in those fields. I am an expert in real estate, but I'm not an expert in, for example, uh, electrical or plumbing or items like that. So we would need to call in the experts to, uh, to know for sure. But this is just a general uh, discussion. So today the topic is septic systems. Again, it's just a general introduction. Most rural properties have a septic system, uh, which consists of a holding tank and a weeping bed. So whether you're buying or you're selling, you, you need to know where on the property the septic system is located, specifically the weeping beds and the access to the holding tank. How do you know that? Well, if you haven't, um, if you're the property owner and you uh, you haven't been paying attention, what you need to do is either call in the uh, company that pumps out your tank and have them show you where that is, or you should have uh, what's called a septic certificate, and it's either with uh, with you or the lawyer or with the uh, township and um, so you can find that out um, when a property is being sold one of the things that a uh, purchaser or a purchaser's agent should be asking for is a, a copy of the septic certificate it's a certificate that's been issued by the uh, installer of the system and it will have um, the address of the property, it will have the details specific to the system that's been installed, the size of the tank, and it will actually have a sketch, and it, or should have a sketch, and it will show in proximity to the buildings where the holding tank is and where the weeping beds are. That's very important because a purchaser needs to know in case in the future they decide that they want to put in a pool or build an addition or they need to do some digging uh, in the backyard or sometimes in the front yard that sometimes the the uh, systems in the front of the house uh, and if they don't know where those uh, items are the holding tank and the uh, weeping bed it can be a very costly mistake and we've actually heard of people who uh, say in the springtime they drive across their backyard only to realize that they've just driven across their weeping bed and that can be very very costly so you want to make sure that you protect that area wherever the weeping bed is and where the holding tank is and that can be all prevented by knowing where it's located using a septic certificate as reference so when somebody's purchasing property what they're going to want to have done is they're going to have the septic system inspected not just um, warranted by the seller but they're going to actually have a qualified septic company come out and write a report saying that it's in good working order uh, when it was last pumped and uh, if it does need to be pumped then we can make it conditional on having that uh, pumped out at the expense of the seller 
sometimes we can have that done but if it was just recently pumped out you don't want to have it pumped out too often you want to make sure that there are contents in a holding tank that uh, that ensures that the system uh, will be working properly um, so the septic uh, certificate will form part of the uh, offer to purchase and that would be important again just like a well certificate um, for the water uh, it would be important for uh, obtaining financing on the property so make sure that when you are purchasing a property that uh, and there is a uh, offer to purchase make sure that uh, the septic certificate uh, septic certificate is addressed in an actual offer to purchase so that's a little bit about septic systems uh, just very very basic information but uh, that's information that uh, I run across and need to convey to either the seller or the buyer uh, on a regular basis in real estate so I hope you find that uh, useful if you have questions about this or any other topic related to real estate feel free to give me a call I love to talk to people about real estate uh, if you're thinking about buying or selling feel free to give me a call as well I'd love to uh, work with you and uh, if you know somebody who is thinking about buying or selling feel free to have them give me a call one of the greatest compliments you can give me is a referral of uh, your friends or family I certainly appreciate that so the way to contact me is I'm at 7 Victoria Street West in Elston that's Royal Page RCR uh, my phone number, Toronto Line, 1-866-772-5368. My local line is 705-435-3000. And my cell is 705-791-2221. Thanks very much for taking the time to listen. As I say, there are other videos, short videos as well on other topics. Hopefully you'll find them useful. And I'd appreciate uh, hearing back uh, please feel free to send a com uh, comment on uh, how you found the video. Thanks very much for your time and hope to hear from you soon. Thank you. Bye.